Christina Lazier, and I'm a fish biologist with the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service, and I work in the Columbia River Fisheries Program Office. Lamprey species in this area are native to the Pacific Northwest and to the western United States, and so they're a very important um, group, of, group of species. And also, the Pacific lamprey in particular is a tribal trust species for the Fish and Wildlife Service. The broad scale goals uh, for lamprey conservation is to uh, increase abundance, um, to know more about their distribution, to know more about the threats that are affecting Pacific lamprey and Western brook lamprey throughout their range, and really try and get a handle on these things so that restoration actions can be completed and um, conservation of both species can be achieved. There's also a large um, question regarding climate change and how it's going to affect Pacific lamprey populations. So we also have uh, completed a climate change vulnerability index to evaluate how Pacific lamprey populations might fare um, in climate change in the future. The Western Lampreys Conservation Team is a group of service biologists from California, Idaho, Washington, and Oregon. Our partners in this effort are other federal agencies such as the Forest Service and BLM. We're working with Native American tribes in the Columbia River Basin and in the coastal areas. We also work with public utility districts and the Corps of Engineers, as well as NGOs and universities. We have initiated the Pacific Lamprey, Lamprey Conservation Initiative, which is a, an effort to understand the status of Pacific lamprey throughout the range and to also uh, gather information on what conservation actions have been, are ongoing or have been completed and also what is needed. The Fish and Wildlife Service along with the Forest Service and BLM has created a document called the Best Management Practices for Minimizing Adverse Effects to Pacific lamprey and it is a document in which it describes how um, people can consider lamprey species when they're doing restoration projects. The next steps of the Pacific Lamprey Conservation Initiative um, is to write a conservation agreement with our partners. Um, because Pacific lamprey are not listed, it's an agreement with states and federal agencies and tribes to try and collaboratively do as much as we can to protect and enhance Pacific lamprey populations. The third phase of the conservation initiative is regional implementation plans. And in this phase, we'll take the information that we gathered on conservation actions and research and monitoring and evaluation that is ongoing, as well as needs in conservation actions and research, monitoring, and evaluation. And it's really to put together plans to implement actions to restore Pacific.